off my big old face. Hey guys, so we are heading out. This is my BFF for hey. life, Erin. And we're heading out to Blue Mountain to Scandinavian Spa. So we're she having... never knew it was there. No, I didn't know it existed. That's in <laughs> Canada, by the way. Um, so we're excited and we're going to document a little bit of our trip. Um, it's just like a one night day thing. So we're so excited. Yeah, and we started off with Starbucks, of course. Woo! Yay, cheers! cheers! BFF's life. Holla. Bye. <laughs> Okay, so we're here. Here is beautiful Blue Mountain where we're not skiing. It's so cute over here. Irish pub. Oh, I think I've eaten dinner here before. This one's a nice place. It's expensive. I like it. And I've been to Firewall Hall Pizza. Of course. <laughs> we went there one night. Oh, see how gorge. Oh, I love it here. You guys should all check it out in the summer. Except there won't be skiing in the summer. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a little nicer to walk. <laughs> it's so cold. Red Devils. So what are we doing for the rest of the day? Oh my god, we gotta go check the factory. <laughs> 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 we have two hours to kill before we head out to our spa day. Yes, our spa day. Spa I'm ready day. for it. So excited. Let's go right now, please. All right, so we're gonna go adventure right now, and then we are going to adventure right now. We're gonna go adventure right now. We're gonna now. go to adventure. And yeah, so we'll talk to you guys later. Holler. So we're finally in our hotel, and Erin is in the washroom. Hi. <laughs> it's pretty cute, just a nice little hotel. Hey. And our view isn't the greatest, obviously. We have the parking lot. We were really hoping that we were going to have the view of the people skiing, but unfortunately, no. So now we're just getting ready, getting our health information filled out before we head out to the spa. Oh, we're so excited. So just filling out my health history. And we're gonna head out, so we're so excited. Can't wait to show you guys what the spa looks like. I've heard amazing. Here we are entering Scandinavian spa grounds. <laughs> we just passed a sign that said, please do not touch or feed the wildlife. I'm looking for the coyotes. I don't see them, so I think we're safe. We're good. Where do I, go? uh, I don't know where to go. Go around one the circle. Way, one way, one way. Oh, one way. Oh. Okay. Oh, two? Scandinavian spa, Blue Mountain. <laughs> We're here, you're not, but you should be. Okay, we're gonna park now. <laughs> Can we get paid for our credential? Well, not credentials. For what credentials? No. Our spa goers? <laughs> no, for, for, what do you call it? Uh, marketing, advertising? Yeah. Oh, dropping the plug that we're here at Scandinavian Spa and nobody else is? Let's start with a C word. Uh, 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 we're on spa time, so our brains don't work anymore. <laughs> we found a spot right here. Look, 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 watch her parking skills. Woo! Crash boom bang. I mean, I'm just joking. Okay, bye. Okay, we're here. We're gonna go inside, and I don't think we're allowed to use our phones inside, no, so we'll have to. I want to film everything. We can film on the walk way up. Okay. Okay. All right. So I can't. I can't talk. <laughs> I have to. I have to whisper. Is it because it's supposed to be like a serene environment? Okay. Like, like, like the monks. Basically, like the monks. <laughs> okay, look at the hill, look at the hair. Come back this way. Over the ski roof. <gasps> oh, so nice. They're going. Going on a bear hunt. <laughs> oh my god. I'm not scared. <laughs> Pathway. Oh, there's a pathway right here. Come. Are you sure? I'm sure. It's pretty, and I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Uh, kind of reminds me of something from Wonderland, like we're going on Timberwolf Falls ride. Wonderland. Yeah. You know I don't do rides at Wonderland. You? We've never been to Wonderland. I ain't going on no rides at Wonderland. I told you I don't do roller coasters. Why? Why? You know that video of that kid? <laughs> that was me. Oh crap. See, I don't know how to be freaking going. You gotta learn. <sighs> it smells like a eucalyptus person. <laughs> Enjoy the quiet. <sighs> this is not somewhere Cynthia should be. <sighs> and no cell phone. <sighs> okay, well. As long as there's no one in the 
I guess I gotta put it away now. Oh, what's this? Guys, this is where I'm going. Okay, bye guys. I'm gonna put my hood on. <laughs> oh. So this is what it looks like at night. Oh, MG guys, this was like the best experience of a life. I can't even explain to you how beautiful this was. Well, we're done. Do I need to and smile it's dark. so you can see me? <laughs> well, I wanted to do the smile trick. <laughs> okay, so you can't really see me, but if I smile, <laughs> <laughs> you can see me. So we're done, and that was like the most amazing experience ever. Do you want to talk a little bit about what we did? So we walked in there, we got ourselves oriented, and we went into the hot tub that was 102 oh, so degrees nice. Fahrenheit. Ah, oh, that's about so hot. I don't know what that is in Celsius. Ask your American <laughs> friends. Hot bath. We went to a hot bath, mm -hmm. and we stayed there for too long because the idea is to go into the hot bath for about 10 to 15 minutes, and then you go do a cool plunge. I don't remember how long it said to do it for, but nobody does it for the length of time. This one here got her foot in it for three seconds and then left. I, <laughs> I was like, nope, not doing that. <laughs> Going back in the heat. But me, the, the island girl, supposedly, mm -hmm. went in, got underneath two shoulders, and then jumped out. And then I was literally convulsing right back into the hot tub. <laughs> and then your feet were burning. And then my feet were burning because my they were so cold and then they were so hot. Yeah. Um, and then the, after you do the cold plunge, you're, or, mm -hmm. you're supposed to go to the rest area. Is that what it's called? You're not even supposed to go right back into the hot water? I don't think so. I think you're supposed to do hot, cold, and then go rest so that your body slowly adjust the temperature, adjust the temperature um, comes back to normal and then you do mm. the whole process all over again three times apparently I don't care to be in and out in and out in and out rest I don't care so we did hot cold for three seconds 30 seconds hot we went yeah. our massages yeah which were phenom because now we're loopy and then we went back into the eucalyptus room which <laughs> It was a little daunting because you know you open the door and you get this whoosh of steam in I your face. I thought it was going in a spaceship. I thought it was supposed to have a spasm. I was like, oh, okay, <laughs> you know the movies where like people are getting like sucked into a spaceship and you see like all that smoke and like blue and purple the lights. Paper. And the okay, so as soon as you open the door and like like the sound, hold on, turn the defroster in my car on. So this like sound was. And then you see, all you see is just steam. You don't see human beings, you just see steam. And, and you're you like, know the humans are in there. <laughs> <laughs> you, can't see them. you get like hit in the face with like eucalyptus smell. And so as soon as it got in there, I was like, because I didn't know like to breathe. I was like, do I breathe? Do I inhale? Like, what do I do? Obviously, you're supposed to because it's like good for you and good for your like. What do you call it? Your sinuses. Your sinuses. And so I was sitting there and I just kept going like this. Because I was like, I don't know if I'm supposed to breathe. It's, <laughs> it's so heavy. Like, it's a very... It's power. It's a powerful <sighs> It's hard set. to describe. Like, how do you describe... Eucaly think of eucalyptus as thicks, right? You know, when you're, there like, you thick as a kid and your mom yeah. takes bags and put it underneath your nose yeah. or on your chest and you get that really strong menthol eucalyptus scent? That's, yeah. That's, that's exactly basically what it was. It was strong, but, like... 10,000 times so well because there's steam and it's in your face and, and then you get like wet so you like just get steam and sweaty and soaked and, and then you're like I can't take this anymore I need to go outside and then you go outside and you're like where's my stuff it's freezing I need to warm up again yeah so then we went interesting. then we went into the even hotter um bath yeah for probably far too long <laughs> yeah yeah and it got to the point where I was like I'm hungry I'm thirsty yeah we're probably and there's people dinner. yelling beside us like 8 30 yeah. anyways and then we got changed showered and it was just beautiful I think just like the atmosphere was gorgeous and massage was wonderful and I felt like she was very thorough and it was nice yeah it was not, good. not as hard as I wanted it yeah she said that <laughs> that's what she that's said what call, that's what we call Cynthia's foot and mouth disease <laughs> excerpt number one <laughs> Um, yeah, some people nice. would say the pressure wasn't as much as I would have preferred. Yeah, yeah but the, it's a would. relaxation massage, but whatever. Yeah, but whatever. Uh, oh, relaxation so nice. to me means get the kinks out. Yeah. But that's just me. So all hungry. Anyway, we are going to go find somewhere to eat, and it was a beautiful, if you ever want to go to Scandinavian Spa, check it out, let us know. Question below. Yeah, question, oh, right, that's YouTube. 
Yo, this is my first time talking to her on YouTube. Hey, my questions well, below. Questions below, comments. Have you been to Scandinavian Spa, Blue Mountain, mm -hmm. or if you have any other spa recommendations in Canada to go to? Be awesome. Peace out. Bye. Yes, I have not washed my face yet. <laughs> I have washed my face. So we are back and we are tired and well actually I'm not tired. I'm like wide awake still. Clearly because I have not washed my face or undid my hair. But I'm in my pajamas in my bed because that's what I do. <laughs> I took my face off. I'm undoing my hair right now. There we go. I'm done. <laughs> I wish it was that easy for me. Uh, uh, so what did we do tonight, Erin? Well, we went out for dinner. Oh, we did. I don't even remember what it's called. Martini something. Tiny martini. Tiny. They weren't tiny, though. They were regular size martinis. Mm -hmm. I only had one. I'm so full. Like, I ate so much food. Do you want to know what she ate? All you people on YouTube, do you want to know what she ate? <laughs> no, it's I'm, terrible. I'm, I'm going to tell you what she ate. No. There was a bowl? <laughs> no. You're not talking. I'm talking. Put the camera on me. <laughs> there was these fries. Golden gold fries. Truffle oh, parmesan. So Let me show you how big the bowl was. It was like that big. Okay. Like that big. There wasn't that many fries. But the bowl was that big. <laughs> <laughs> I did assist. But she ate most of them. It was so good. And she doesn't normally eat fried food. No, I never eat fried food. And now I feel so sick and... But it was worth it. So much for having a detox last week. <laughs> what detox? You were on no de You're always on a detox. <laughs> what detox did you do? I did a raw juice detox. A what? Raw juice detox. It was so good. You can start again tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, it was good. And then I was so angry because when I got my main dish, I ordered salmon with... Cream corn. Cream corn with kale. And I asked them not to put the bacon in it. And they put the bacon in it. And they chopped it in tiny little pieces. So I just sit there and sift out the bacon. <sighs> yeah. So annoying. That was kind of a mess. Yeah. But well, what was your drink? What did you have to drink? I had a Prosecco. Prosecco? Prosecco? Mm hmm I had a Prosecco champagne. It was so delicious. And I actually finished finished my drink because she never finishes her drink i never finish my drink unless it's water um, i had a frostbite martini which is some kind of vodka and some baileys and some something and then i had a glass of red wine with my medium steak mm. and some veggies it was delicious oh but my appetizer was a panko crusted goat cheese. Oh my god, that was so good. Oh, and I'm not even supposed to eat wheat, but I had one. You had one. It was so good. It was delicious. It was better than my fries. Even though it had truffle oil all over it. Yeah, it was good. It was good. <laughs> and now I'm happy and I'm trying to drink water. Lots of water. That's why I'm not going to sleep yet, because I need to finish all my water. Before I go to sleep. So I might just watch TV and... And I'll just snore away. <laughs> and she'll probably videotape me. <laughs> just letting you know, I have not given her permission to do so. <laughs> it's going to be at the end of my video. Don't matter. <laughs> I'm just going to start snoring now. I forgot my earplugs. I'm going to have to homemade, home make my own. Seriously? <laughs> Rude. <laughs> and this is my bestie. Yup. Whatever. Yup. She should know better. Yeah. Well, it's not that bad. Sometimes I can sleep to her rhythm. <laughs> Depends if... It's not like my dad. My dad has the worst snores. Mm -hmm. Anytime I'm in the downstairs and we're sitting at nighttime watching TV shows and I, like, start to fall asleep on the couch, as soon as that man starts snoring, I'm, like, going to bed. This is the most obnoxious snoring of life. I can't even handle it. So, his I cannot fall asleep to. Mine is just a matter of being able to breathe. Yeah. yeah. You had a eucalyptus steam. You should be able to oh, But that was like hours ago. <laughs> just saying. And I had alcohol. 
Could you imagine how well you would sleep right after a eucalyptus steam mm-hmm. bath? Yeah. Could you imagine? Literally, though, after that eucalyptus thing, I could not. I breathed the best I've breathed in my entire life. You should all do it. That's why I put a little bit of eucalyptus in my massage lotion. Yeah. And people just... have colds and stuff. Oh, it feels so good. Just like that. Just like that. Yeah. I kind of want to make my own little eucalyptus steam at home and just... You could do it. Breathe in and then go to sleep. All right, loves. We are finally saying goodnight to our lovely spa adventure. Mm-hmm. And we are going to say goodnight till the next vlog. So long, farewell, auf Wiedersehen, goodnight. Yeah. Arrivederci. <laughs> Buona notte. Buona notte. Tutto. Tutto. Mm-hmm. Tutto. <laughs> she would. She would. She'd know what it means. Okay, good night.